Okay, just a uh, little update on my uh, water batteries. These are zinc, copper wire, and just plain plain tap water. This this three cell set right here has been lighting that that red LED nonstop. At the end of this month, it will be two years old. So that. <laughs> Two years lighting that LED off of that setup. Now I've cleaned this uh, two, three times, and and added water every three, four months. But uh, those are still the uh, the same pieces of conduit, and uh, going pretty good. So I decided to uh, take take what I learned here, and and apply it to something kind of fun. And so here's here's my new build. Uh, in this one, I've got four four cells, same same thing, copper wire conduit, just plain tap water. Uh, my my circuits on the on the back, and uh, I put yellow yellow LEDs on this one. Uh, I I thought it thought it was kind of neat. So. Uh, Hopefully, this this will run a couple of years. Uh, something kind of kind of interesting on this. This is using uh, inductors in the oscillator, and over here, the, these are lid motors. And I don't know if you can tell, but these two, this this red one and uh, the red pancake and the penny. They sync up. They'll 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 flash together. This one, they're totally independent. Now, these two circuits are connected identical to the same four, uh, set of four cells. Uh, I didn't split the cells. The four cells are in series and uh, running both oscillators. But each oscillator runs independent of each other, where where these sync. Now um, these these two are being run by an, a cell that I made several months ago, just out of uh, some zinc that I made a big zinc slug out of. A little copper foil on the bottom. I've yet to add any water. Um, It has just, just been running like this uh, since I started. And uh, you, can, you can see what's, what's going on in there. But that's just tap water, zinc, a piece of felt separating the, uh, the zinc from the copper. And, uh, and that's been running, running several months now. And it's been driving both of these, uh, both of these blocking oscillators. So it's it's uh, it's doing quite quite a job. Uh, I'm, I'm real happy with that. I'll see if uh, if it if it lasts as long or, or longer than than this set of three. But uh, and then of course some more fun here. This is a uh, magnesium in copper running my little whale. So let's turn some lights off. And and there you see the whale. Those are those are uh, lid motors oscillators blinking there. And I think I think with it a little darker, you can see how those those two lights sync up. And of course this new guy here, and and that I think pretty well shows that those are not those are running independent of each other. And of course the the red LED. So. I think one thing to note here, we, we make a lot of uh, homemade batteries. And just like you go to the store and, and uh, you know, you can buy single A or double A's, triple A's, C size, D size, 12 volt, 9 volt, different size batteries for different applications. Well, we can do the same thing with these that we make. And these little water cells. Uh, you know, two years running running a uh, a single LED 
that, that's pretty darn good. Uh, so you got a light load, uh, boy, these, these things are, are the tricks. So I thank you for watching.